I was letting my dog out this morning so she could stretch her legs, get her a little running around, zoomies out. And while I was letting her out, I seen a group of geese flying south, right? It's, it's gotten cold here in, uh, in the Detroit area. It's gotten cold here, so the birds is leaving, right? So I see these geese flying south, man, and it was one in the front leading, and then they was like in a V formation, and it was probably, I don't know, eight to nine on each side of the V, right? One in the front, a line diagonal going back to the right, and a line diagonal going back to the left, uh, like eight or nine of them joints. And it was two groups like that, and they all was just flying in the same direction. And it just made me think, like, and it's immediately in this moment, it just made me think how things are designed a certain way by the creator, right? And it also made me think that us having human, uh, us being humans and having free will, having the freedom to do whatever we want and think however we want, it a lot of times comes to our detriment as people. These birds was doing what they were designed to do without having to be told by anyone or instructed by anyone. They were just doing what naturally comes to them, right? And looking at the leader, the leader geese, goose in the front, lead this pack of other birds and they are just following the lead bird. I don't want to say blindly, but they're trusting that this one in the front know what he's doing and know where he's headed and knowing the direction that he's in and they don't have to be told anything right it made me think like if a bird wanted to if one of the geese wanted to just veer off and go a different way it could do that right they're they're choosing to and deciding to follow this one lead goose or geese follow it down south because this was we was designed to do right we're moving within our purpose and we're moving within our design of how things were supposed to be at some point man we've gotten so far away as people from moving in our purpose moving in a direction that we were designed to move in doing what we were supposed to do we've gotten so far away from that it's just chaos right now it's like the world is chaotic because everyone has an opinion. Everyone has the free will to do what they want, to think how they want. You know what I'm saying? Like, and it's like the world has gotten much worse with this way of thinking and with this way of moving. I don't see a lot of progression. Maybe in technology, we're progressing in, uh, you know, what the, the way of living. Things have progressed, but just as a human civilization, we're at least in the u.s it seems way more chaotic now it seems like we're way further away from moving in our purpose and moving like these geese that i seen this morning and i think that life is a lot easier when you move in your purpose and you move in a direction that you were designed to go instead of being a bird that could just veer off and go and do your own thing Right. And not move within your purpose and not move within the way things were set up to be or created to go. If you if your life is in shambles right now, if your life is in chaos right now. Right. Just really sit back and think what I'm saying. Like the analogy, it makes sense. Really sit back and ask yourself, like, am I moving in purpose and am I moving in the way that I was designed to operate? Because this whole willy nilly freestyle every part of your life, it ain't working. It's a lot of people that have no structure that's not moving in any type of structure. These birds was flying in uniform, bro. Like it, it almost looked faked how perfect each one was in their right spot and they're flying. They're not stationary. And they all playing their role and they moving as a group and moving as a unit to get to the to the goal. 
So ask yourself if your life is in shambles, if things not going your way or if things don't feel right within your life, ask yourself, are you moving within your purpose and are you moving within the way that you were designed to move, that you was created to move? What comes natural to you? What feels natural to you? We trying to go against the grain way too much as a people and we need to come back to the basics for real. Look at the animal kingdom, look at nature, how things just operate and how things just move naturally. No resistance, no one one bird thinking that they're greater than the other birds and they need to go off and do moving as a unit to get to the to the common goal, bro. I can't tell you the individual that's watching this video what you should be doing specifically, but each person knows what comes naturally to them. Each person knows what feels right in the moment. And each person knows deep down inside what you was really designed to do, what you were really built to do. What did God create you for? What did God create you to do? And us as a people, it's a lot of individualism going on right now. It's not enough unity. It's not enough togetherness. So you really got to ask yourself, yo, am I moving in my purpose? Am I moving in the way that I'm supposed to be moving? And am I moving like these birds? Am I moving like them birds? I know. Like, I seen them for a split second. It was three, four seconds. They flew past quick. But I know they're going to get to where they where they trying to go. I know they're going to make it. Just based off that little three, four second span of time that I've seen these birds and how they, I know they're going to make it to where they're trying to go because they're moving in unison and they're moving in their design. They're moving within the guidelines of how they was created and, and what they were created to do. They operating from a place of purpose. So I know they're going to make it. And I know none of those birds is going to venture off and say, oh, I'm going to do my own thing. Keep that in mind, man. If your life is not moving how it's supposed to move or you're not in a spot that you feel like you should be in, you probably don't veer it off. You probably don't venture it off course and you got to get back on course so you can make it to your destination. Make life easier, man. Stop making things so difficult on yourself. Look, man, I got a Patreon in the description below. Join that. Sign up if you want more game, if you want more exclusive content. Please like and subscribe to the channel. Please. I appreciate it. Leave a comment below too, man. And I got more videos on the way. Peace.